guys. My power supply burned out. I shorted, I didn't see that, uh, it's burned. So right now I make my own. This is transformer. I use uh, microwave transformer. This is fan to cooling and this is rectifier inside. And uh, that way I be trying to recover my gold with electrolysis. So let me see, put everything together and we start looking how this stuff works, okay? I co collected on a graphite from a battery. I took it out the center and I connected to my wires on the plus. No, man, minus, minus, what here be minus. And plus, I just connected a regular nail. Oh my goodness, how hard to work outside. This is regular bolt for minus electrode. So I be right now putting in and we be making gold from this solution. Oh, connecting electrodes. This is minus and plus I be putting electrode like regular nail and turning on my power supply and starting process you see on this place you see right away gold precipitating and falling down okay and solution getting brown because gold precipitates Okay. You see how fast? When in solution you have gold, then you don't have any problems to get that gold out. Okay? It's already everything precipitated. We keep it for a few minutes more and yeah? and stop reaction because we have enough iron in this solution. It's like it's working with the iron sulfide. It participates all the gold with no problem. Okay. See, when I touch the surface right away, some kind of reaction starts. And gold right away become a gold. It's like a brown powder in this solution. Solution get hot. It's like always normal because I put in 12 volts and about 10 amps. I guarantee here is because I see water, everything boiling and getting hot because of that. Cut is a reaction going and everything gets hot and that's it what like for a few minutes i hold it everything get, became brown and we can stop reaction let him settle down on the bottom okay so iron goes in solution it participates gold this is very simplest way to recover gold. You don't need to do nothing too much. Okay. I think it's enough. Everything is done. So iron nail, like you see, where is that? It's became clean, nice, white. So it means we, we get the gold out and this one, it's nothing changes, okay? This is uh, graphite from batteries, okay? So gold is participated. Now we just need to wait. Wait like a few hours till everything settles down. So I try to, to do that for you. The solution is all brown still settling. It's past like one hour. 
And this is, I have another solution where it's very little amount of gold. Let's see how this works with that, that uh, electrolysis, okay? This is very little amount of gold. Let's, let's put it everything in. Turning on and let's see. Look in this one. No gold falling, you see? When it's very little amount or almost nothing, you don't see gold forming on this electrode, on the plus, okay? So, you see how different? You right away see, that, can you have a gold or not? This is very little amount. I can see little dust coming, but that is miserable amount of gold. So we'll be keeping for another like few minutes and we'll see how everything works. You remember that one? solution when I was doing it right away became brown here nothing I, I I can keep it how long you want there is no gold in this solution so you see this is one of ways to figure out do you have a gold or not in solution stannous chloride showing me gold but in electrolysis, I didn't see any gold. You see the how long already? It's nothing, nothing. All not changed colors, nothing. Difference, you see with the gold, brown without gold, it's nothing. I just testing a few rocks. I decided to dissolve and see how everything works. But like you see, when it's no gold, there is no gold. Okay. So now I can keep it this one how long I want. If the gold already be precipitated. precipitated. But in this case, you see, I don't have anything. So color no changes. You see the bubbles coming, but the gold. I didn't see any gold coming. A little bit started, looks like, what here. Looks like a little bit something. No, there is gold, but very little. If there is a lot of gold, everything becomes brown. And that little gold is actually nothing. And you can keep it how long you want. You see, like, right now I can see there's something falling from that nail. But the gold is very little. Okay. I put urea, put everything. And solution changing the colors, but very slowly. It means very little amount of gold. It's just, it's not worth even working on this kind of amount. Okay. So that is one of ways to figure out do you have gold or not. If you put a nail and you don't see anything falling down, it means nothing. You look in Steiner's chloride test, looks like you have something. But when you put the nail in the electrodes in, in a solution and you don't see nothing, I see the very little amount of falling something, but that is just barely is something inside so actually like that much is enough to hold it because all iron already went in solution and uh, it's no point keeping longer because you just getting more iron in solution and the solution becomes dark brown too but there be no gold okay so i taking out uh, and I can tell you, this solution don't have a goal. Very simple. See the difference? This is settling down. It's another another 
maybe two hours, three hours, all gold be on the bottom. Uh, this one, leave it for a few hours and we'll see do we have something on the bottom. Uh, if there is gold, we will see on the bottom. But that takes, uh, need to wait like three, four, best thing I, I wait overnight, but uh, today two, three hours and you will see results. Okay.